and welcome back to another Bob Blast. I'm Bob Burridge, and this is the fourth approach to this painting of a series I've been working on, The Polyptics. And hopefully I get to finish it this time. You've been following me all the way through. Thank you so very much and for sharing the post. And now, this time, I get to finish it. Let's go. But first, I want to pull all these panels together by drawing on them with this water-soluble crayon. Here we go. But before I do that, I just thought that you know I have all laid out here my paints. I have gold paint. I have Holbein's fluid acrylics. It's transparent. I have some white and some black. And my brushes, pretty simple. And now I'm ready to get going. Here we go. So I'm just drawing just for the sake of drawing. And I'm kind of pulling them together. By drawing all of them all at the same time, it helps to unify the figures. If you remember, off to my right, you will see the original figures that inspired me to do this, this painting, which was called Equality, right? Here we go. I just love drawing. Because I don't know how it's gonna turn out. And now I'm gonna add water, it's water soluble. Get one of these goofy brushes. Oh. See, now it's starting to be pulled together. It's because the same technique is on all of them, the combined technique. It's still adding a little bit of mystery. Oh. Now the next thing I'm gonna do with the same brush is I'm gonna pull it together with a, a gold acrylic paint. Here I go. I'm using gold as a nod to the Byzantine painters that used gold leaf all the time. Let's take some transparent fluid acrylics here. The, the good thing about transparent is that you can keep painting on top of it and don't lose the paint underneath it. I paint quickly only because I can't wait to see what it's going to look like. Now it's starting to pull together. I like it. It's dramatic, lots of lights and darks and lots of color. My job is now stay away from it, let it dry. Hey, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed watching this series. Uh, this is the fourth one of me putting together my polyptics. I'm gonna be doing a whole lot of workshops this year 
based on a lot of prolifics and creative painting. Stay tuned, I'm gonna tell you all about the dates. So I just realized I didn't have a chance to show you all the individual pieces. So remember, I started off with equal. This was the name of the series. I wanted to have a, two different, a couple on a sofa, and this was the result. Looking at this, you can see I pulled all the pieces together by combining the backgrounds, lots of drawing on all of them. None of one of them stands out individually. The whole idea was to pull the whole thing together using the same technique, and the same paints, and a very limited palette, and lots of drawing, and still make it very graphic and really strong. I love doing this, so thanks for watching. I really appreciate it, and uh, I'll see you on the next Bob Blast. And so I have another workshop coming right up here in March. San Miguel Dayate. Who doesn't want to go there? San Miguel Dayate, Mexico. I love it. I'm returning there. I do it many times. One of my favorite places. It's March 19th to the 25th. And we just found out there's an opening. One more opening. So if you hurry, check my website, robertburridge.com. And you'll see all the details and more of my workshops. Thanks for tuning in. And don't forget to share this. Take care.